Hey, welcome back everybody to my Hunter series, and we are picking up right where we left off. We're actually going to be finishing up a mission up on, um, Histern Fault, if I, I cannot pronounce that to save my life, but a German, um, a German, uh, map, I guess you could say. So, anyway, uh, before we do, let's equip our stuff, though. So, uh, a couple updates. I got the Whitlock, um, for closer range, effective at 75 meters and less. Very powerful gun for deer, um... If they get like less than 50 meters, um, much better at killing close range than the Dokken or the point two two three. So the Whitlock model, model or the thirty thirty 30 bullets is what it's used. Excuse me. Uh, but let's uh, get the other stuff though. So we are, I am keeping a handgun for right now, but I am going to probably get a different handgun for when we get closer to bigger. So we'll get the road there. This is there elk? There is wild boar in this map. Yeah, and we don't need a moose, but we can use a red and row scent. Did we unlock anything else? Uh, let me check if we unlocked any scents. Hmm, elk scent. about lures. Let me lures. Alright, let's equip our stuff. Alright, so we're definitely getting up there. We're level 21 now, so hopefully uh, we can make it to level 22. Um, let's look at our stats real quick. Still having a hard time getting... Uh, there we go. So, getting there. Close to the bus, surely. Alright, and let's oh, we go through the front. Right, this is where we need to go. Valider, perfect. Nice little warm kill before things uh, get serious. What is he doing? Ah, oh, he just wants to stand still. I think that was a direct hit. Well, it was a direct hit, but uh, I mean a direct kill. These shots are getting mighty beautiful. And let's look at the ballistic report. What does it say? Shot trophy rating 76. Hmm. A distance on that. Mm -hmm. Good practice.
So it's going down a little bit. So he goes back to eating again. Jeez, I, for some reason I'm wobbling. Okay, it's uh, the long range shooting is definitely not easy. Let's see what we hit. Okay, flash one. It's definitely not dead, and I'm not gonna chase it. Yeah, yeah, I'll tell it. We'll we'll deal with that later. I was talking about. He's not here, is he? See if you can find some trace of him. I know I heard a deer around here somewhere. It looks like a donkey more than a deer. Oh, he started running. should be a critical shot, but you never know. Bring in Flesh Boon, really? Alright, I'm not chasing after them. Since I'm on doing a storyline mission, I'm only... I only chase them if it's a critical hit, otherwise it's going to take forever. Fine, exactly. You found something? Let's see where it leads. Well, I know that this is not the boys. These footprints are, are his. Uh, where did he run off to? Um, wait, no. Can't track his footprints.
Not in a traditional sense. Serious happen. Not sure what kind of parent would uh let their kid. Thought I was a deer for a minute. That's Eric's bag. He must have been headed in this direction. I'll let your Linda know. Keep following his trail. Okay, this has been his track up here. Damn boy, how far did you run? Just called me. They found him. A neighbor in the area saw him on the head after hearing where he was headed. If you hadn't found his trail, he might have wandered further into the woods and gotten into some real trouble. Thank you so much for helping out. Sure, anytime. Have you run across Albertina yet? No? Albertina Fleischer. She's one of the locals. She's a real red deer admirer. We've got a lot of those here, as you can tell. One of her friends is a taxidermist, and apparently he promised to stuff an animal for her birthday as a gift, as long as she provided the materials. You see where this is headed, right? Yeah, she loves red deer so much that she would like one harvested and stuffed to display in her living room. But she'll pay well, so are you up for it? I need a harvest a red deer with a goal score or higher. Ugh. That's gonna be hard. Um, but we can get the bison. As she will no doubt tell you if you ever meet, her love for red deer comes from an episode in her youth when she got lost in the woods. Apparently, she was able to find her way home by following one that appeared in front of her. Interesting. I think we'll do this bison mission next. Red Deer is kind of tough to get it going right now. So, Dr. Bandari ran some tests on the blood sample you took, and I'm afraid it's bad news. It showed signs of brucellosis, a disease that can cause miscarriages among the bison. Zomel wasn't too thrilled about introducing bison to the reserve in the first place, and if this were to spread to any of the other animal populations, he might pull the plug on the entire project. Bandari identified a few more bison that were afflicted. He's asking for your help with containing the disease by downing the sick ones. Alright, we're going into Bison's territory. I'm gonna need a bigger gun. Alright, use the .27 for 
the, the bisons, that should be good. Alright, so the bisons are over there. Look at it. It has all the signs of the disease. Take care of it. In this stop. At least I shot him though. Didn't quite get gold, but hey, it's worth it. Damn, this fox is hard to get. He is down.
Come on, just a little bit closer. Perfect. Let's see what we got for this one. 207? Uh, I think that's the, the highest trophy rating that I'm seeing since I started. Uh, I got that purchase the trophy rating. Gold. I got a gold. Yeah. Trophy rating of 200 or above is what I need, apparently. Wow. Score 948. Is that my highest score to date? That is my highest score to date. Nice, 948. Over there, another sick one. Damn it, I wish the one I wanted to shoot was closer. It does say sick. All right, here it goes. Try a bucket me? Alright, so need one more.
don't want to risk taking a long shot and not, and not being critical and I have to chase him down for like a really long time. Play it safe. It's like you, you move slow, but then you finish at quicker in the end versus moving fast in the beginning it takes longer to finish in the end. And by that I mean you take slow to creep upon the predator, pick your perfect shot, and make sure it's vital or instant kill and it's much smoother hunt versus trying to just shoot 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 from afar or as soon as you see something. one hopefully That one's the best shot. Oh, this one's pretty good. Yep, that was vital, I can see from here. Good shot, buddy. Just fell down. Okay, this will go far in containing the spread of the disease. Thanks a lot. It seems that word is spread on your work with the bison. Maybe you've heard of Malvin Tesla? He owns a company called Star Hunting Tours and hosts clients who come out to the reserve to hunt our big population of wild boar. He was grateful for your work with Dr. Bandari in containing the disease. As a result, it did not spread to the boar population. He asked me whether you might be interested in assisting him as well. The wild boar population is concentrated in the northern parts of the reserve, but they sometimes move south, and Zomel is not happy about it. You see, they have a fondness for Zomel's crops. Tresler and Zomer have been at each other's throats about the boars lately. And if you could help out by creating some hunting pressure at the crop fields, that would really help defuse the situation. For now. Sure, as soon as I get this last bison. Take this from right here so he doesn't get any farther. T 
Two shots should do it. That looks like a vital. nice one all right that's gonna be it for this uh, video wow bisons and uh, some foxes well and a lost kid oh and I leveled up too perfect Let's uh, see how much money we have. 31k. Okay. I'm getting up there. So, and look at our, our recap real quick. Hunter's log history. Got a 948 today on a roe deer of all things. Wow. A roe deer hasn't been on top in a quite some time, actually. So, roe deer is actually my highest score right now to date. Uh, see if we could uh, get beat up with a red deer or even a fox. Foxes are so hard, though. But thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And uh, if you're playing this game, let me know uh, on Xbox One. You know, we could definitely uh, do some... Up to eight people could play. So I'm, I'm definitely game for looking for more people um, who want to play. So, alright. See you guys in the next episode. Bye.